your girl Candy Glam and thanks for coming to my channel. Today I will be giving you a wig review and a how to style wig review on Amber 26. This is not a new wig. It first came out with Amber and now I'm doing the 26 inch. And this will be my first time reviewing this. So you guys, if you wanna see how I'm going to style this wig, please stay tuned. <laughs> This is the finished product. Um, I wanted to do this hairstyle again because a lot of you had a lot of questions on this hairstyle when I did it on the, uh, the Ultra Ashani wig. I will link that down below as well. I did get a lot of views on that, but I did have a lot of questions on it. Um, but you guys, I will say compared to the Ashani wig, I love this one better. The texture of the hair is 10 times better. The Ashani wig, I think I wore it for two days and then it got tangled, so I wanted to come back and do it on a hairstyle or a hair texture that was just a little bit more better, and I definitely love this one a lot better. So before I get started on it, I did want to show you how it looks. Um, this is Ultra Quick Weave in the style Amber 26, and I do have it in the color S430. Um, I know that the, the camera's picking up that my natural hair color is a little bit darker, but I am in between hairstyles. I have had my hair straightened for two weeks now, and it has a lot of buildup in it. But my hair is a little bit lighter than what it looks on camera. But you guys had a lot of questions on how I did this style, so I wanted to do it again. So let me just give you a full 360 really quick. So I normally would put more hair up top for the sake of this video. I wanted to do it quickly so I can explain how I did this. As you can see, I have put my natural hair up and I did twist my natural hair around the loop that's holding it up and I did pour some of my, pull some of the um, hair from the half wig into it. Now, a lot of you had a question on how it is covered in the back. Now, what I tried to explain is that this hair is long enough when you pull it up into the top part, because this is a half up, half down hairstyle, when you pull, of it, pull it up into the top part, it is long enough to cover all that in the back. So you can bring as much as you want up front because it's long enough to cover what's going on in the back because I'm pulling it from the very top. So that's why I can get away with this. Even it's covering the sides for me, not even keeping it up. Now again, you guys, I do have a lot of build up in here. so. I did not want to go and snatch all my life out because it has a lot of gel in my hair, unfortunately. After this, I will have to go wash my hair. But, you guys, I'm actually loving this wig. I have had no shedding, and I'm actually pulling. You know what? Maybe I spoke too soon. I have one strand. One, I don't know if you can see that. One strand coming out. But you guys, when it comes to synthetic wigs, and especially half wigs, um... Well, not even especially half wigs. When it comes to synthetic wigs, period, you will have shedding. It is synthetic. Um, I will say the construction on this cap is superb. I mean, it's a half wig. And um, as far as the texture, I've already said I love it. And I am 5'2", you guys. Well, let me say this. I am 5'3", okay? I am 5'3". Um, I think I've grown. <laughs> But I am 5'3", and it's actually, when it's just curly, I'm not messing with it, it's 
below my boobs. It's uh, right under my boobs. But when you pull this hair out, it actually is waist length. And from the back, you guys, it's just absolutely fabulous. But um, you guys, please let me know if you like this um, hairstyle. Please let me know if you have any questions. And again, I will link the review down below for the shiny wig. I did the exact same hairstyle. You seem to have a lot of questions on it, so I wanted to do it again. But yeah, if you want to see more of my how to style half wigs and then blend in your natural hair with this type of hairstyle, let me know. I will go out and just do tons of hair half um, wig hairstyles. I seem to get more views on that. And I did not, this is not sponsored and this wig was not sent to me. I did buy this with my own money and I got it from my local beauty store. So it was, um, I believe it was $21.99. The old Amber, this is Amber 26 inch. The old Amber was $19.99. But I will also link down below how much it is online. And so yeah, if you have any questions, stay tuned. You know, I have more coming. And I hope that you really enjoyed this hairstyle and this tutorial. But um, yeah, I'll have more coming. And yeah, thanks for coming to my channel. This is your girl, Candy Glam. And bye.